This is a gas line. You can't tell okay. by that big smile on her face. How are you today? But it's been a long week of work for Lisa Rubio. You need gas? A traffic director of okay, sorts. Okay, the line's right here, okay? She's the keeping line? these cars in line. Yes, ma'am. Literally. Everybody's trying to rush and everybody's trying to get, get gas. It's about noon right now, and as you can see, the line to get gas is at least half a dozen cars deep, and this is far from the worst we've seen it. We've actually seen this line stretch out into the road. It's been hectic. It's really been hectic. It's a long line. Everybody's trying to fill up the generators and their cars. And In a town where the gas won't last. At the end of the day, our pumps are empty. You're bound to find a wait. I guess about 35 minutes. And a lot of people who don't want to. Yes, I get cussed at, yelled at, but you know, it's, it is what it is. Everybody's Everybody's stressed out, so I understand. Uh, go ahead and go to number five. It's amazing okay. how nothing. Five's right there, okay? Nothing. No, ma'am. Can get this girl down. There's nothing else to do but be positive because in the long run, I mean, if you if you have a negative attitude, it's not going to make anything better. Thank you. They say a smile <laughs> can be contagious. See, that's the kind of attitudes we need. You need gas. But maybe. Whatever. It's Lisa's outlook on life. Go all the way around to number one. We all ought to be catching. We just need to work with each other and help each other out. And we're all going through it. Everybody's going through the same situation. In Victoria, Texas, I'm Leah Lynchide for WISC News 3.